channel. It's Brittany if you're new here. In today's video, I'm going to do a meal prep with me. Today is Monday, so I'm always off on Monday. So typically this is when I get to go to the grocery store and just kind of stock up for the week and just kind of get ideas what I want to do for the week. So I've been trying to eat a lot better lately and get my health back in check. So if you're interested in that, just keep on watching. So the first thing I'm going to do is hard boil some eggs. So this is always a quick and easy um, snack to do or breakfast. So since I work, I like something that's quick and easy and that's on the healthier side. So I'm just gonna hard boil some of these eggs first. eggs in here so I'm just waiting for the water to boil and once it starts boiling I'm gonna have it sit for 15 minutes and then once that's done then I'm just gonna put them into ice water to stop the cooking process and then they'll be easier to peel all right so now while the hard-boiled eggs are boiling I'm gonna cut up some produce and just kind of have that stocked up so I'm gonna cut up some celery because for lunch options this week I'm gonna make a Chinese chicken salad so I put celery in that but I also like having celery on hand just to like dip with peanut butter or just to have it by itself so and a little hack um, on keeping celery more fresh I cut it up and wash it and then I'll keep it in a Ziploc bag with water and that keeps it fresh and um, lasts longer so I'm gonna do that first <laughs> snack peanut butter hummus or just by itself so now I have a healthy option and um, it's already cut up so it's super easy to grab on the go or to bring to work all right so the next thing I'm gonna do is just cut up some bell pepper so I'm using the bell pepper in the salad as well so um, you can use any color you like I just like the orange ones it just makes it a little um, sweeter in the salad and then I also have my chopped up celery to go as well I'll just drop some on the counter um, this salad is super easy. All you need is celery, bell pepper, um, green onion, and um, some chicken. If you don't feel like making chicken, I just got the rotisserie chicken already um, cooked, so I just shred that. And then um, cabbage, and then you can add sesame seeds if you'd like. And then I'll show you the dressing I got for later on as well. So I'm going to cut up some onions right now. You are, you are, you are, you 
just got done cutting up my bell pepper and then I just set a tarm timer for the egg so they're boiling so that's gonna boil for 15 minutes so now I'm going to cut up some green onion <laughs> done cutting up my lettuce or my cabbage so it's all in here and then I'll usually put it in Tupperware I won't mix like everything together it's just so everything's fresh so it makes it easy because everything's already cut up and then so now the timer's going off I'm gonna put the eggs in ice water now one, two, one, two, three. I've been feeling so small watch the clock ticking off the wall but tonight I'm letting it go Spend my coin for sure I'm gonna be myself or I could be some Alright, so the eggs are done So I usually just let them sit in here for a couple minutes And let them cool off And then I will peel them So doing this makes the eggs stop cooking And then it makes them actually really easy to peel off So you're not trying to fight getting the shell off so now I'm gonna cut up some English cucumbers. So I'll put this in my salad as well. Um, like I said, this Chinese chicken salad, you can do whatever you want with it. So that's the nice thing about it. But I like having cucumber on hand um, just to dip with hummus too for a healthy snack. Drive a faster car. Lay my troubles to rest. Blow the smoke through my cigarette. City lights looking fine. And I know this is my time now. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. cucumbers cut and ready to go to have for a snack or to put in with a salad so it's really nice I've noticed if I just prepare and have everything ready to go because cutting everything up tends to take the longest and since I do have a toddler he's napping right now I just like having th everything ready to go just because I notice if I don't do that then I tend to not go for the healthier option just because I'm starving by that point you know or I'm just rushing to get out the door so it's just so nice having everything prepared so you guys just need to pick out a day of the week that you have time to do this and it makes the whole rest of the week flow it's really nice especially since my parents help watch my son I like having options for them too and um um, and for my son as well. All right, so the last thing we need to do is just shred up the chicken. So I'll just shred this up and I'll keep this in Tupperware through the week. I'll leave this um, just so I can have options for salads or make like a chicken wrap or just whatever, something quick that's already done. So let's just do that. And like I said, you don't need to make the chicken unless you want to. I just did 
um, a rotisserie chicken for today just to see. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. Try not to hold me down, feel alive when I'm in this town. Think and break me. option of the whole salad but that's okay it gives it a little crunch I just get top ramen and just crush it up so that gives it a little texture so you don't have to do this step if you don't want to but it kind of makes it um but yeah super easy you guys just pretty much just cutting everything up now I have chicken prepared for lunches for the week or snacks I got cabbage cut up so you can really do this with anything you can do it with regular lettuce if you want a meal prep salad so I figured I would do a series of um meal prepping for the week and just give you guys different recipes so let me know if that's something you would like to see and then for dinner option um I'm not doing a dinner option um during this video later in the week stay tuned me and my husband are gonna do a cook with me he really is a good cook as well if you follow me on instagram you kind of just see he might see cooks a lot for me but i really enjoy it as well um but for the most part he cooks dinner so i thought that'd be fun to do in a different video and show you guys some healthy dinner options so this is just kind of a meal prep for the week of snacks and on the go breakfast so now i'm just gonna chop this up for you guys to go so like I said I'm gonna have these for breakfast or for lunch so it's just super easy to grab so you have the healthy options there all right so here's how everything is laid out you guys so I have all my ingredients for the Chinese chicken salad chicken and the cabbage so now I'm gonna put the salad together for you guys today I usually don't use this one the one that I wanted they didn't have so but this one looked good it's the simple truth organic orange miso dressing so it says sweet and savory with orange tamari ginger miso and sesame so I'm gonna try this out and let you know how it is And this is how it looks like with the dressing. It looks so good, you guys. I can't wait to try this out. All right, so I'm gonna try it out for you guys. Just mixing it all up. Looks so good, super fresh. 
perfect summer lunch or even dinner idea if you want a lighter dinner option. Mm. Oh yeah. That dressing's really good. So just put as much as you like. You can also top it off with the mandarin oranges, but I honestly don't really like those, so I'll do it without, but that's usually a staple for a Chinese chicken salad. Mm. Really good, you guys. All right, so that's gonna wrap up this meal prep video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I gave you guys some ideas, kind of what to plan out for the week. You got the hard boiled eggs, um, chopped up some vegetables just to have healthier options for snacks and the Chinese chicken salad super easy to make all this took me a little over an hour just because I was filming as well but I usually do this when my son is napping so it doesn't take very long you guys so I hope you guys enjoy this video and stay tuned for some more cooking with me and cooking videos with my husband as well he's a very good cook if you follow me on Instagram you see I post a lot of my dinners from him so I thought it'd be fun to share with you guys and just to give you guys some ideas so give this video a thumbs up if you liked it subscribe if you're new and I'll see you guys very soon bye <laughs>